Good day. And the continuing series of equine stewardship presented by Equine Challenge, we're going to talk about probiotics today. There can be, and there probably is, a great deal of confusion about probiotic product, this product, that product, the other product, which one did it get? The most important thing to get for your horse is bacteria that actually is alive. We call that viable bacteria. The vast majority of products on the market, they can stay on the shelf forever and a day, is because they don't use live bacteria. Generally, they use something called an extract, which means the bugs are frozen, freeze-dried, if you will, and the enzymes are extracted, put in a, a box with some byproduct waste, and you feed it to your horse, and you get enzymes. But you're not getting live bacteria. So that being said, when you're looking at those labels, and you're looking for probiotics for your horse, you want a wide spread of bugs. The more bugs, the better. But if you can have 15 different bug names, but if only two of them are viable bugs, and the rest are extracts, not good for your horse. So how do we determine the difference between viable bacteria and extracts? Quite literally. Uh, for an example, I'm going to name a bug that we use at Equine Challenge called Lactobacillus plantarum. If that is followed with extract, you know that that is not a viable bacteria. A viable bac bacteria will always be followed with fermentation product. For example, they'll say Lactobacillus fermentation product. That is an actual bug. Bugs only live four months. Four months, that's it and that's all. So if you're using a product that has a lot of extracts, it can stay on the shelf forever and a day and there's so much it won't do for your horse. It won't reproduce itself, it won't create vitamin B, I mean uh, B vitamins, it won't produce antibodies or cofactors. So all it's going to do is digest your food. Well, you want a little bit more from your bugs. So looking at that label, insist upon fermentation product when you're looking at your bugs because they will actually be alive and you, your horse cannot get too many bugs and it requires bacteria to break down its food so don't, don't give it just enzymes give it the real thing bugs bugs and more bugs and when I say bugs I'm talking about probiotics if you have any questions please give us a call at equine challenge and thank you for your attention have a good evening